Oh, hi YouTube! This is the Minecraft Maniac coming to you from MinecraftManiac.com and of course here on the YouTube platform. Welcome back to Series A. This is a, a new episode where I have skipped ahead a little bit from the viewer's point of view because the recording that I was making um, failed and so now I'm just kind of starting where I left off and skipping ahead for where your perspective is. I journeyed away from where my shelter was and headed over uh, across that body of water. I made a boat and now I'm climbing up this mountain and now I'm realizing that it is actually getting dark and I am I'm considering that the uh, best thing to do here is to head back and ow that hurt. Uh, so what I did on the way over in this direction is well, it's really getting dark. I better carry a sword. I put torches on pheasants' posts in order to mark my way so that I would not... Oh, there's a cow. Uh, I, was... I was going to try to lure some cows back to where my shelter is so I could farm them. But I don't have time in the dark to do that. Nor am I carrying any wheat with me. So, uh, these torches were just an idea to make it easier to get back without getting lost and so far they're working very well I've spaced them out relatively well and I can see one from the next so I'm gonna jump in this boat paddle back to where the nearest torch is across the sea that's not the button I meant to press and I'm hoping to get back to my shelter without running into any hostile mobs, but it is dark, and that is a distinct possibility here. So, I have to break this block so I have someplace safe to land. Back to carrying the sword again. So wish me luck, folks. Hopefully this isn't uh, a clip that I end up putting into the video series I'm working on called So Many Ways to Die in Minecraft. I think I need something to jump up on here because I'm kind of down too low. Yeah, I am, I am just sure that any second now there's going to be a skeleton, zombie, creeper, or spider coming out of the dark. I saw some motion over there. What was that? Oh, just a chicken. Yep, there's a spider I was worried about. But fortunately, I am close to my shelter. So I should be able to run and make it back safely. Yeah, excellent. Good night, everyone. Sleep well. And good morning. Let's check and see if there's any coffee. Nope, but there is iron. Iron is handy. Gonna roast this raw chicken that's right there. And just in time, because look at my food, my health, my food level. Filled right up. Let me check and see what the status of my wheat farm is. No hostile mobs. Just doing a quick check around. That has a lot of green in it. This one looks like it's ready for harvest. It was. Very good. Plant those seeds over again. And then since I have more seeds, I may as well plant those too. Oh, and I have pumpkins now, too. I don't think you saw that part when I was chopping pumpkins up. So I'll plant those over this way. Keep in the wrong button. I mean, if you're going to farm, you may as well have pumpkins. Which I need to process using the crafting table. Twenty-eight pumpkin seeds. That's crazy. Mm, do 
so why not just plant them here next to the door? I may as well. So I'm kind of glad that I made it back safely, but I was thinking, when I travel that far, what I probably should do is take the bed with me so that I can turn the night into day again. I mean, otherwise I'm going to be in the dark or have to build a makeshift shelter uh, just wherever I happen to be and hope that it's safe right there. Let's see, I'll do two rows of pumpkins since I've got a million seeds. Not a million, but you know what I'm saying. I keep pressing the wrong button. Um, I also have sugar cane that I picked up, so go up here along the shore and plant that and see how much of that grows. Alright, this is starting to look like an actual real farm now, so that's pretty good. Look at all that cobblestone. That is a crazy amount. So I have five pieces of iron. The question is, what can I do with that that I actually need? Um, I am fully armored. You know what, what if I make a map? sure that if I typed in map I would see the recipe for a map. Where's that zombie? Then where's he hiding? I heard him growling away. That's weird, huh? bad time to fall. It's funny, I've literally never been over this far to where the ravine is. far down. There's more iron on that side too. That's excellent. So the question is how far down do I have to go to get to that iron that I saw? Let's see if we crouch and creep forward a little bit. I think we're right above it. But you know what you don't do in Minecraft? You don't mine straight down. So let's not do that. I love the glow in the dark moss or whatever that is. Iron, more iron. Well, YouTube, I appreciate you watching. 
I'm coming to the end of an episode here. I'm going to grab this iron before I close the episode out, but uh, I'm trying to keep all of my episodes about 10 minutes or so, and the timer in the background tells me 10 minutes has passed. So I just want to say thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day, and until next time, bye!